good or good evening? Good evening, Lisa. So today I'm gonna ask uh, if you have any uh, funny story uh, that you experienced in Japan. Okay, so that's a hard question because there are so many, but um, I do have one story that I keep close to my heart. Um, mm -hmm. I went skiing mm -hmm. with uh, a friend named mm -hmm. Mr. Kato mm -hmm. and uh, Mr. Pete Price. Mm -hmm. And we went to uh, not a, well, a ski slope, but it was a uh, artificial mm -hmm. kind of snow. Mm -hmm. And um, we were skiing on the regular slopes. It was good. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, you know, me, I'm into snowboarding and I wanted to go to a higher slope. Mm -hmm. So I checked with the, uh, well, Kato, Mr. Kato was okay. Mm -hmm. And then I asked Pete because that was the first time I went skiing or mm -hmm. snowboarding with Pete. Mm -hmm. What are you eating? And I asked Pete, hey, are you okay with this kind of, this is the, <clears throat> the advanced course. Mm-hmm. And he said, yeah, I'm okay, no problem, no problem. Like, okay, well, let's go. And <clears throat> so we went. We went to the top of the slope, top of the lift, and then he went first. Mm -hmm. And uh, we watched him, me and Mr. Kato from the top. We watched him go straight down. Yeah. No turning, no control, nothing, just straight. Mm -hmm. And at the bottom of the hill, he just went bam like this mm -hmm. and me and mr kato looked at each other ah oh, right we better get down there <laughs> and then we got down there and he was he was out he was not in a good position he was in a bad place yeah was she was he okay no no he after that we we took him to uh um we took him to the restaurant yeah and he was just he could I, walk? He could walk, but I, I think he had a concussion, basically. Concussion? Yeah, definitely had a concussion. Seriously? Yeah, yeah. And then the, I think it was the next day or the day after that, I saw him at work, and he had a big <laughs> bump on his head. And then I knew that that was a serious thing. Yeah. He, he was really hurt bad. And that was one of my... Uh, yeah, I guess funny stories, interesting stories. Uh -huh. So, uh, did you guys go ski again? We did. Yeah, we did. Um, other, let's see, we went, oh, I can't remember when, but we did. Mm -hmm. did, uh, did he get any improve? Well, he switched to snowboarding. Um, if I remember correctly, he mm. did switch to snowboarding. And that was more difficult than skiing, so... He was really angry the whole time snowboarding because, you know, he's a beginner at snowboarding. And... Yeah. 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 I found uh, snowboarding dif more difficult than skiing. That's funny because I have no idea how to ski. Oh, really? I only grew up on snowboarding. Um, did you do uh, skateboard? I did skateboard. Oh. I didn't do surfing. I did bodyboarding. Mm -hmm. But the idea is the same, you know, ride ride the wave. Yeah, yeah. So that, like uh, skateboarding and uh, surfing and body, body yeah, bodyboard yeah. is kind of the same. Yeah. And skis, since it has double two legs, uh, yeah, two legs, yeah. So it's more like a, a roller blading, roller, yeah, yeah, roller yeah. skate, skate yeah. or roller skate. Yeah. Since I uh, roller skate, oh I really? Used to roller skate. Oh and, really? And sta skate on the ice. Ah, uh, ice skating, so, right? Ice skating. Okay. So uh, it's much easier for me to ski in that sport. Right. That makes sense. Board. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Okay, thank you for your time. Thank you very much for the interview. Talk and to you next goodbye. Time. Bye. Okay, yeah.